when Perrine was rescued from the illegal wildlife trade. She was close to death. She had a fever and most of her limbs were paralyzed. This is Perrine's story, one of hope and second chances. The Jane Goodall Institute gives chimpanzees a safe haven at the Chimponga Chimpanzee Rehabilitation Center in the Republic of the Congo. Hundreds of chimpanzees have been rescued and given a new home at the sanctuary, the largest in Africa. Perrine was our little miracle. She arrived at Chimpunga Sanctuary in December 2019 after being rescued by a team from JGI and PALF, the Wildlife Law Enforcement Project. We weren't sure she would survive. Weighing less than two kilograms, four pounds, the teeny Perrine was anemic and suffered from hyperthermia. Our veterinary and caregiver team acted quickly to start round-the-clock care. After giving Perrine a blood transfusion, they monitored her every move. Caregivers kept her warm with hot water bottles. They held her close to share their body heat. Slowly, Perrine began to heal. Perrine, when he was there, he was coming. He was very sick, Perrine. He was fatigued. Il ne mangeait pas, même l'eau il ne buvait pas, mais on a forcé, on a, on a protégé avec les serviettes pour commencer à donner un peu d'eau, l'eau de sucré. Euh, une solution, on a fait solu les solutions euh, au sucré, on donnait avec les céréales, parfois 2 millilitres. Essentiel qu'il est, ça vale un peu. Within three months, she had made a full recovery. Our caregivers then helped Perrine learn how to flourish in a chimpanzee community. They slowly introduced her to Zeze. Even after her rough start, Perrine showed that she was friendly and loving. She and Zeze formed a special bond that has never been broken. When we are in the forest, often with Perrine, Perrine loves to sleep. Quand il joue avec les autres, quand il est fatigué, il dort. Mais comme il est trop petit, mais son ami Zézé est toujours à côté de lui, de lui surveiller, même nous les soigner. Perrine was soon able to be integrated with other infants in Chimpunga's designated nursery group, an important step in giving young chimps the social experience they need to develop. Though Perrine was the youngest in the group, she quickly adapted to the rhythm and routine. Today, Perrine is thriving in her new life. She loves playing with her friends. They explore the world around them in the safety of the sanctuary. They get exercise and find tasty fruits and vegetables. We named Perrine after the PALF coordinator who helped save her life. The name Perrine comes from the French word for rock. With the help of our caregiver team, Perrine has shown that she is indeed Chimpunga's rock. You can help us give Perrine and chimpanzees like her a safe haven at the Chimpunga Sanctuary. Visit our website to learn more about the Jane Goodall Institute and how you can share in our promise to never turn away a chimpanzee in need.